I am Patrice Baker, and I have a question for you. Has anyone believed in you more than you believe in yourself? Do you remember how that made you feel? As an adult returning to school later in life, I remember a time when I was stuck. I was in one of my favorite classes, English, and I was failing. You know, where there's more red marks on the paper than black ones. And so I knew what I knew what to do. I went to my teacher and I said, you know, I'm going to quit. And to my surprise, Dr. Nancy Nonfest said to me, you're a good writer. Hang in there. Correct a few things. So I did. And when I got my final grade, which was an A, I was so excited. I tearfully called her back and said, thank you so much. This time there were tears of joy. You know what she said to me? She said, you did it. You did it. And I know that you can do anything that you want in your life. Anything that you desire is available to you. You just might be stuck or overwhelmed or not know what to do next. As a girlfriend of mine said, help is on the way. For more than 30 years, I have been empowering and giving women the tools to have their voices heard and to succeed from the mailroom to the boardroom. As an inspirational speaker, trainer, and success strategist, that's another word for coach, I will give you the tools to find more joy, to feel better about yourself, and to create the space to receive all that you deserve and desire so that you can become unstoppable. My keynote presentations, half-day seminars and programs, full-day programs and one-on-one -on -one coaching are available and I can't wait to give you the seven strategies to take you from stuck to unstoppable. I like what Carl Sandburg said about dreams. He said nothing happens but first a dream. How many of you have a dream? All right. And when you had that dream, how long was it before it turned into a nightmare? Oh. <laughs> Those phrases that I heard growing up. This one really stuck out in my mind. You might have heard it also. And it is, sticks and stones may break my bones, but words absolutely. Is that true? No. However, sometimes when we hear these things, we take them at face value, especially when they're told to us by our parents. Right? We're taught not to question authority. So they must be right. And so I went through most of my life thinking, well, something must be wrong with me. Because I was getting hurt all the time. Words were hurting me right and left. You know, I don't know if I was just a sensitive child or what. But I felt like something was wrong with me. Until one day, I was driving along as an adult. And I saw this sign and it said, sticks and stones may break my bones. But words can break my heart.